Welcome to Ewape Culture Village, a place located in Nagalama, few meters away from Kampala City. Oh, Uganda, Megoda we lend a future in thy hands. United, free for liberty together we Ewafe Culture Village is located in Nagalama, Kayunga Road, a few kilometers from Kampala City. The main reason for Ewafe Culture Village is to conserve the culture norms of the central region, that is the Baganda culture, and also to prevent the young generation from being carried away by the Western culture. Activities in Ewafe Culture Village include food preparation, bark cloth making, local brew making, koja and senga session, fishing, and many others. In Baganda culture, visitors are given a warm welcome as witnessed here at Iwafe Culture Village. In Buganda culture, a vista should be served with coffee beans and banana juice. You can't let a vista go on an empty stomach. Water is fetched in a pot and one is supposed to fetch water either in the morning or in the evening. Fetching water past midday is prohibited and one is not supposed to use the same route he or she used while going to the well. That means when you're coming back from the well, you have to use a different route. One needs a head drink called Enkata in Luganda for is a carrying of the port from the well to home.
while making this lock brew we need elephant grass yellow bananas water and millet Matoke being the staple food, there are different types of matoke such as nachitembe, chibuzi and others. And here is a unique way how matoke is prepared including the sauce, call it luwombo.
In Buganda culture, diseases are treated using local herbs and there are different types of herbs with different diseases they cure. Plants that they use to make Vaseline for our hair. And another thing, it's good for skin diseases, skin rash. You can also use it. You can use it like the way it is and you just rub on your body like this. So that it prevents skin rash from your body. Then a natural power bank for me. They can use it. Then the natural power bank for me. Then we watch film, you know, Shira Kiyamakawa, people with a hard problem, they can also use it. You boil and... The types of fish caught here include tilapia, catfish, mudfish, and silverfish. These fish are caught using fishing rods, and this is a traditional method of catching fish. In this world, you only find it in the part of Africa. Yeah, it's so sweet. Um, it actually, that's how, so you eat the seeds, and they're so juicy and tasty. Yes. Charging, when I go back home, ah, Justin will know it. It's gonna be fire. <laughs> yeah. This is called sparring days. Sparring days, yellow banana. Mmm. Uh, 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 this so guys, so guys, right now we're going to be tasting fruits. Yeah, as you can see, this table is full of different types of fruits, and all these are. Old. This is the fruit. Called penne in my local language, straight from the Ewafe village, straight from the garden. Now this is my favorite. Guys, right now, this can going to be trying jackfruit. This one, right? South Africa. They want to feed it. My colleagues are told that the taste is much richer than the jackfruit you eat in Kampala. Uh, that is because usually the jackfruit they bring in Kampala is half ready. They drain it. I think it's about one and a half hours from town. But Jalu Lava Masao and look at these. They look like colorful. But 
it's locally made actually. I really, really. So I'm trying out this lumber for the very first time today. Mm. So I hope I'm going to live. I have matoke. We don't have matoke in Holland, so I'm trying all these foods for the very first time today. Yeah. Greens to the cocoa tin it in its soul. This is very delicious. What's your best? Do you know we have to use hands here? Traditionally, mm. as Baganda, mm. you have to use your hands, you have to pick your food. This is called Luombo, and the way I have to. Open this, I have to be careful. Mm -hmm. And I need to be, I don't have to be so fast. <laughs> Lest it will pour. <laughs> yeah. So, this is it. You need to see what we have here. I think this is, um, oh, this is chicken. Mm -hmm. Guys, it's been a day here at Ewafe Culture Village and we are saying goodbye to this beautiful village. Thank you so much for watching. Please, if you haven't subscribed, please do leave a like. Till next time, bye.